Today, May 23rd, marks 10 years since the death of former President Noh Moo Hyun, and thousands, including politicians and former U.S. President George W. Bush, are expected at Pungha Village to remember the liberal politician who fought to challenge regional divisions and authoritarianism. As trade tensions heat up between China and the U.S., China's top diplomat says Washington's pressure on Chinese firms such as Huawei is, quote, economic bullying, while the U.S. Treasury Secretary is still hopeful that the two sides can get back to the negotiating table. North Korea's ambassador to the U.N. in Geneva claims that the U.S. seizure of a North Korean cargo ship is the biggest stumbling block to improving their relations amid the stalled denuclearization talks between Pyongyang and Washington since the Hanoi summit in February.